Hi everyone, Mike Ballard here with NEC. We're going to show you um, a new application we're working on called Clovaris. It's an interactive room control for hotel rooms. Uh, it also integrates voice into the application as well. So we're going to go down here to this. To, this would be um, an interface that you could have inside the hotel room. It runs on Windows XP, so you could have it on really any device. Right now, we just for ease of demo, we have it on a uh, an XP tablet device. So here's the interface. Typical uh, hotel thing. So we can go in here and we can control our room. We control the lights, the drapes. We can even control the air conditioning uh, from this application. We can also um, go in here and do get a hotel guide. So restaurant information, spa information. In addition to that, if I clicked on, let's say, the spa, I can have information displayed about the spa, and I can simply hit the uh, touch here to call and actually call the spa with a, with one click. Also, if you notice, uh, there's some advertising we can put on the side, so we can schedule advertisements to be displayed in the room to the guest, and we can even target it down to that specific guest. Other things, of course, wake-up call, that's pretty popular. Um, the, the real fun one is actually phone. So this could actually be a phone system or a phone uh, telephone that sits in the hotel room. So we can make calls outbound as well as inbound. So we can label this button, let's say front desk, and we'll call it service. What it's doing right now is it's calling over on here, which would be what the operator's uh, computer would be, running uh, our Sphere call software. And right now I've made the connection of the phone call between the two. And right now, technically, they're talking to each other. Now, we can also add a video element uh, to this where the, uh, the guest would see, there we go, the guest would see the operator. Now, the operator can see the guest, obviously, because that wouldn't make a lot of sense privacy-wise, uh, but we can have video calls that way. We can also have a, su a support mechanism, so almost a concierge mechanism where if the guest was asking, let's say, for directions to somewhere, over here as the operator, I can go in here, I'll select uh, the room I'm talking to, Oops. Uh, and I already have a predefined map for they want to know where the convention center is. What this is going to do, it's going to bring up a map of the local area, and we can go in here and actually display this to uh, its support. Actually, yeah, actually display this to the guest on this device. So you can see there's a map on both locations. So the guest is seeing what I'm seeing and displaying. Then I can go in here and, and, and even annotate to it. Um, so we can go in here and we'll make a circle. There we go. So you can say, hey, you're, you're located here and you're going here. If you notice, that's now translated over to the actual guest machine as well. Uh, also another thing too is for internal use, so staff use, let's take an example of housekeeping coming into the room. They can go into a secured menu and type in a username and password. You can also take different um, key card passwords as well. And as you can see I displayed with uh, different options as an internal, internal user, staff user. So in this case if I was in housekeeping, I can get my rules for what to do with this room. I can say I could start it or I completed this. So it goes to the back office and, and housekeeping management can see the status of rooms um, and, and um, what's going on and as far as the staff goes. I'm going to make a log out. Also an internal telephone that they can use that way. So with that, it's a high-level overview of Clovaris. Uh, it's, a, it's a guest portal inside the guest hotel room with integrations into Sphere Caller voice system. Thank you for watching.